Well, you downloaded your car's owner's manual in VR because it's finally useful. You probably missed the skateboard stroller, the giant Magellan telescope going up, and using 3D touch to make sick beats. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where musical Marvel Gem only flopped at the box office because they took out Synergy, the coolest part of the franchise. Synergy, we need to look like exterminators. Making music on the road can be done on various gadgets, but now native instruments have stepped it up a notch. The iMachine 2 app for iOS uses Apple's 3D Touch to record the difference in how hard you tap on the pads and modifies the sound accordingly. The app can make complete songs, not just loops, by recording live sessions or building up arrangements. Then you can take your track to the studio and export it. It's cool, I'm ready for this. I've been making sick beats since 1987. Thank you, Simon. Space nerds rejoice! Construction on the giant Magellan Telescope in Chile has finally started. That's three years after blowing up a peak on the Chilean Andes. It probably helps that the US, Australia, Brazil, and Korea all agreed to fund $500 million of the project's cost. The giant Magellan's main mirror will be 80 feet in diameter and is made up of seven primary segments. One's already been polished to an accuracy of one millionth of an inch. With that kind of detail, we're expected to see things we've only imagined might be there. And then there's Rectus 9 and uh, a villa, um, Trash Can Man. Want to give your kid a taste of what it'd be like to be in Mad Max Fury Road? Yeah, you do. Now you can, sort of. With the Quinny Longboard Stroller, you can take the half-formed human that you've already sacrificed so much sleep, money, and sanity for and strap it into a car seat on the front of a four-foot-long skateboard. Don't worry, this thing is totally safe. See? It even has handbrakes so you don't have to drag your foot to stop. Solid construction. Just add a man bun to that dad and you'll be all set. Remember, Billy, tuck and roll. And finally, Japan is back to prove it has its priorities exactly right with this invention. It's a two-way, long-distance game that connects human and cat over the internet. And when the cat hits its toy, the human's hand gets scratched. Worth it. Happy Friday the 13th, y'all. Don't get jasoned.